raises our glass at this American life. And if hearing the sound of my voice, chances are you have heard these pledge drives come and you've heard them go year after year, and you have never pledged. That's what statistics say. If you're hearing my voice right now, you probably have never pledged yourself. And I think I may know why. I think that you have noticed that even though you do not pledge personally, somehow this radio station stays on the air. Right? I mean, come on. You hear us say, you gotta call, you gotta call, and then you don't call, and <laughs> the next week, the national programs roll out every day, and you have not given, and Scott Simon and Neiman Totenberg somehow do not end up homeless on the street, right? And you have drawn the only possible logical conclusion, which is, it doesn't matter if you call. We will stay on the air. And I'm saying these words, and this is actually the greatest heresy a person can say during the pledge drive. I'm gonna say them again right now. It doesn't matter if you call. I want you to remember this moment. You're never going to hear these words again on this radio station during the pledge drive. It doesn't matter if you call. I'm just going to say the absolute truth here. But frankly, I don't think that that is the whole picture. Because although reason tells you that we're going to be fine if you don't call, and Reason has dictated your actions during every pledge drive till this point. You've been utterly reasonable. You've followed logic perfectly, right? I'm here to tell you, you gotta walk past reason. You gotta see reason standing there in the corner, you know, smoking a cigarette and looking all smug, and you're gonna walk right past reason. You're gonna walk past what is logical and what is reasonable to what is actually a bigger truth, and that is that you wanna do what's right. And you know, okay, you know that you listen to this radio station all the time. You're hearing me right now. It's not even a program right now, okay? This is a pledge break, okay? That's just how much you listen to this radio station. You listen during the pledge breaks. And what is right? In the simplest way that we teach a five-year-old, you know, here's what's right and here's what's wrong. What is right is that if you use something or depend on something or share something, like you share this radio station with all the other people who listen to this radio station, it is only right to help out and keep it going. If you were to explain this to a five-year-old right now, you would say, that's what's right, and it is not right to let other people, people just like you and me, middle-class people with normal jobs and the same responsibilities that you have and I have, it is not right to let other people shoulder all the burden. You know? So yes, you do not have to pledge. We're going to stay on the air if you don't pledge. Somehow, we're going to come up with the money. And that's why it's such a statement when you walk by the logic of that, the undeniable logic of that, and actually contribute. That's why everybody who contributes the first time, that's why they always say, it felt so good, it felt so good, you know? Because it's such an act of, of faith and community and, you know, we're all in this together. You know, because the truth is, we are all in this together. You and me and all of us. It doesn't matter if you call. We will stay on the air. And I'm saying these words. And this is actually the greatest heresy a person can say during the pledge drive. I'm gonna say them again right now. It doesn't matter if you call. I want you to remember this moment. You're never gonna hear these words again on this radio station during the pledge drive. It doesn't matter if you call. I'm just gonna say the absolute truth here.